In this short video, we will demonstrate how the new ODB distributed SQL database scales elastically on demand while maintaining full ACID compliance. We are demoing an online application called Storefront, which uses the new ODB database and connects to it through standard JDBC connections. Storefront simulates shoppers' browsing products, adding purchases to a shopping cart, checking out, and writing product reviews. Now let's switch to the storefront demo screen to see how new ODB is designed to scale dynamically, out and in, across host machines. In new ODB, transactions are performed by in-memory processes called transaction engines or TEs. To increase database throughput, add one or more TEs. If less throughput is required, you simply remove a TE. Although new ODB operates at in-memory speeds, it is a general purpose database. Similar to the transaction layer, the storage layer is designed to scale out for high availability and redundancy. As you can see on the screen, we are running Storefront in the AWS US West Data Center at 100 concurrent users with 200 transactions per second, or TPS, shown also in the large graph below, and a latency of around 20 milliseconds per transaction. As more shoppers, in our case 500, get online, Throughput will be decreasing below 170 TPS and latency will become unacceptably high. Since we want our customers to have an excellent online experience in our store, we'll simply bring new TEs online to handle the increased workload efficiently. To do this, we will fire off three new TEs on separate host machines. As the TEs come online, transactions are now being distributed equally across all four TEs. Notice latency is rapidly decreasing while throughput is increasing in a linear fashion to around 900 TPS. This on-demand scale-up performance behavior is one of the key advantages of the new ODB distributed architecture. Now let's reduce the number of concurrent users down to 200 while we continue to distribute the workload across all four TEs. As you can see, the transactions per second decrease in lockstep with the number of concurrent users which suggests that the database is over-provisioned. Because of new ODB's distributed architecture, we can stop TE processes without bringing down the database. As we cut the number of TEs to two, you will see that the TPS and the latency stay the same while using half the TE resources. This proves that the database was over-provisioned. This elastic scalability ensures that you use only the resources you need when you need them. What we've seen in this demo, in real time, is that it's easy to add or take away transaction engines to ensure the best database performance at the lowest latency. Just download NuoDB today and take Storefront for a spin.